We have a heartbreaking update to a story out of Miami Gardens. A four-year-old boy who police say was burned at the hands of his mother's boyfriend over the weekend. He died earlier today at a hospital. CBS 4's Hank Tester spoke with the boy's mother tonight. He's live at Miami Gardens Police Headquarters. Hank. Well, it was an apartment of horrors in Miami Gardens. Now we can tell you the horrible child abuse, police say, it was awful, but now there's charges of molestation, sexual molestation, and it horrified members of a child abuse advocacy group. Here's the story. Amigos for Kids dedicated to preventing child abuse. This day, an art contest, winners from area schools. The theme, paying homage to victims of child abuse. And heavy on the mind, the brutal death of a four-year-old Miami Gardens child. Totally heartbreaking, heart-wrenching, and we're here to help. And we ask anyone who's in need of help or guidance or support, get in touch with Amigos for Kids. Too late for the little boy, as his mother's boyfriend, 23-year-old Khalil Jabail, currently stands accused of... All right, Mr. Jabali, good morning. So you're being charged with child abuse, aggravated child abuse with great bodily harm or torture. And what was the result of the torture? The bond court prosecutor. He has tremendous injuries, brain contusions, bleeding around the brain and the chest cavity, broken ribs. Um, they do not know if he is going to survive. And if he does, he will likely be in a vegetative state. The four-year-old did not survive. The brutality discovered when his mother took him to the hospital for burns over 15% of his body. Caused, Khalil Jabail told police, he heated up a bowl of water in a microwave, left it on a sink after the child wet his bed. Jabail said he was going to use the water to wash the child's clothes. He claims he found the child on the bathroom floor moaning and skin peeling. Prosecutors didn't buy that after learning the last time it happened. He washed the victim's clothing in a washing machine. And what else went on inside the apartment in Miami Gardens? Police investigated reports that Jabail had molested the boy's six-year-old sibling. As a result, he's charged with lewd and lascivious molestation. Well, I talked to the mother uh, a little earlier this evening about all this, and she said the guy who did this, which was her boyfriend, deserves to be in prison for life. I'm Hank Tuster, CBS 4 News. Back to you.